Given the Carabao Cup runs come to an end against Premier League opposition, what did you make of the uh, performance tonight? Yeah, it was um, it was a tough game, no doubt about that. But I think a, a game on a night that we'll be much stronger for. Um, it was always going to be a, a massive challenge, irrespective of how the game went or, or which team picked. Of course, we had you know so many players coming back into the team from injuries and, and from missing long periods of time that we needed to get match minutes into because they're going to be massive for us over the next six weeks. And then to concede an early goal against a really good Fulham team was always going to be a, was always going to be a really tough game. Um, but look, I'm, I'm pleased with how we stuck at it. I'm pleased that we you know, kept trying to the last minute. We tried to stick to our football. Um, and there's big positives that we can take from tonight, to be honest. Um, you know, not least that at the end, the last 20 minutes of that game can go in a very, very different direction if you don't have the right spirit, if you don't have the right um, togetherness and mentality in the group. That game when, you know, they're bringing on starters to strengthen a team and we're bringing on lads who, you know, we think have a big, big future at the club. Um, that game can go in a really different direction. But... You know, we, we kept going. There were some really good moments of resilience. We then get a goal and we finished the last 10, 15 minutes trying to push, trying to get a goal with another chance or two, um, looking fit and fresh and, and pushing to the end of the game. So, you know, in that alone, we can take big, big positives of, on top of, of course, the fact that we've got, you know, so many minutes in a really high-level game or against a really high-level team into players who are going to be, you know, very important for us for the schedule that we have coming up. Was the team selection an indication that, that the league is clearly top priority? Yeah, I think that's you know been the the selection in every every game in the competition, and we've we've done you know well to get to this point. Had three really good performances in the, but this isn't our this isn't our year. This isn't our time to be in a position to you know go and go and chase this trophy. Hopefully that'll come at some point. But you know we're in the ma middle of a massive transition to the championship the boys are coping terrifically well but the physicality and the step up and demand of the league is is a is a big big difference the players are pushing to their to their physical limit and you know we're looking at a period now of of oh, Saturday away game Tuesday away game Saturday here but more so after the international break I think I'm not sure between the the first game back after the international break and West Brom and, and Stoke on the the um the second, first or second of January, I think it's maybe eleven or twelve league games. So we're about to go into the most intense period, the biggest demand that this squad has been through, and we're going to need everybody ready to compete. So again, coming through that game tonight, approaching and attacking the game in the way that we did, trying to do it in our identity, albeit in really difficult circumstances, um, that will stand us in good stead over the next six weeks and beyond and um, there's lots of positives we can take from the game Axel's debut tonight what did you make of him? Yeah I thought he did really well to you know play so many minutes first and foremost it's testament to his professionalism and how he's been training and applying himself since he's arrived and probably before that as well so first and foremost great for him to, to get through the game with no issues didn't you know necessarily expect him to play 90 but we, we agreed that we would you know go as long as he felt comfortable and we wouldn't make the fifth sub until you know, to check if he was feeling good, but he was feeling good, and he got through the whole game, and um, yeah, did some good things. Of course, it was a, it was a big challenge for everyone, but did some good things, some good defensive moments, some good moments of distribution, um, some moments that you know he'll be he'll be better off in in a week, you know, three weeks, six weeks. Um, but I think really good to see him out there.